What's up guys and welcome to another video. Today I'm going to take you through my entire uh, deadlift workout. It's the compound that I get uh, the most questions about. That's why I decided to make this video. So that I can show you how an entire deadlift workout goes for me. Now, it's not exactly an entire workout because uh, I do my deadlift as part of my pool routine. And before starting off, obviously, I do some light stretches, some light dynamic stretches, like warm up your shoulders and stuff like that. And then I start and I get right into it. And the first set that you already saw is just a set with one plate at each side. I shoot for 10 reps just to warm up the body. Um, I'm gonna speed up the clips in between because not a lot is happening in there. So it's just putting on some extra plates and me resting because that's something that I do a lot during compound lifts. Um, during my compound lifts, I'm always looking at my watch. I always work out with a watch. When I do my hypertrophy movements, I use my watch to make sure that I don't take too much rest. Uh, when I'm doing my compound uh, exercises, I'm doing the opposite. So I'm using my watch to make sure that I take enough rest. Um, when it comes to my warm-up sets, I just go one plate, two plates, three plates, then I add a half plate, and then I go right into my Wendler sets. When I'm performing my warm-up sets, I don't like to use straps, I don't like to use my weightlifting belt. So me like when I get to uh, three and a half plates, then I start using my straps. I'm not training to perform in a powerlifting competition, so I have no problem whatsoever to use straps or lifting belt, that matter. Um, so we're already at the last warm-up set, so as said, I'm using straps at this point. Um, during my last warm-up sets, I do uh, three reps of the exercise just to keep my body warm, to make sure my central nervous system is getting used to lifting a heavy weight, and then I know that I can go into the heavier sets. So. I did a review of the Wendler 531 program in the past and I still, I'm still using it and I still love it to death. I think it's a really great program and over the past, I think uh, one and a half year, it has helped me a lot to gain a lot of strength and to reach PRs that I wouldn't even dream of hitting. Um, I remember that I was actually scared to hit certain weights, uh, especially when it comes to the squat or the bench. Uh, because with those two, when you fail, you end up underneath the bar. And with the Wendler program, it showed me that I can lift a lot more than I thought I could. So the first Wendler set, five reps, went pretty easy. Now, uh, especially with the Wendler program, when I'm doing the higher rep exercises, so uh, the first week and the first set during uh, your PR week, uh, those are actually the most um, challenging for me when it comes to compound exercise because I'm not that used anymore to doing uh, high rep or higher rep exercises, when it, uh, higher rep sets when it comes to uh, compound lifts. So those are actually the most challenging for me. Uh, during the past couple of weeks, the PR attempts have gone really great. I'm not gonna spoil anything, just this video, but the next video will probably be the uh, video where I show you my final numbers for 2018. And I can already say that those have gone up a lot compared to the ones of 2017. And I'm really excited to show you guys that. So the, after this, we've only got one uh, set left. And I want to show you guys that raw because it's a PR attempt. And the entire uh, workout builds up to that. So the program makes sure you're warmed up to do it, make sure your body is ready to do it. But do make sure that you take enough rest because that's why in between sets I'm looking at my watch. But I'm also using my phone for that because normally when I'm working out I don't look at my phone too much. I try to keep that to a bare minimum. But in between my um, sets uh, for my compound exercises, I actually tend to grab my phone to make sure that I take that rest because as you've probably seen throughout this video, I pace a lot 
and that always happens when I'm doing um, deadlifts or uh, squats. But here it is, the final set, my PR attempt. That's going to be it for this video, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. Please hit the like button. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. And as always, see ya in the next.